day. Today's our day off uh, from camp, so I came to the great campus of UCLA to go and see my sister. I'm here with Sid. So I haven't seen my sister in like five or six months now, so I'm so excited to see her. Uh, she just won a national championship yesterday, so. so let's go find her. Let's go see where she is. What is she, where is she? Did I not call that that was her? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they were really excited. Dad was crying. It was really cute. Of course, Dad was crying. Was crying? I was sobbing. I don't even know. I was bawling my eyes out. Just same thing at the World Cup. Was <laughs> <laughs> well, oh. I'm a little sad that you waited until I graduated <laughs> to win a national championship, <laughs> but I'll take it. <laughs> Go ruin! <laughs> Just kidding. She Thanks, knows Sid. I'm proud. She knows. Yesterday in North Carolina, we played Florida State and we won one to nothing in overtime. And it was the first national championship for UCLA women's soccer, which was really exciting. <laughs> we, the last time we saw each other was at that game at Gillette Stadium when she scored. Was it really though? Yeah. Okay. I remember it was, no one really knew what happened right away because it happened so quick and she just happened to be in the box at the right time and she got her first goal and I started crying and I turned around and saw my parents and they were crying and it was very emotional and I was really glad that I got to be there to see it and I was just really proud of her. I, she's always been like really close even though, I mean not physically but uh, we talk a lot and I have always looked up to her as a role model so just having her forging the path that I want to go into is been great and I like always have someone to look to for advice and for help and to set an example so um, she's helped me like a lot in my soccer career and in, in everything else too so it's been like awesome I couldn't really ask for something much better. It's been an amazing run with her I mean we played with each other the U17s and the U20s which was amazing I always thought it was really special to have a family member on all the trips and all the tournaments and stuff you know like she chose to you know kind of go off and like do her own thing which I kind of envy her for you know like she kind of took this upon herself and she did this on her own and I envy her for that and look up to her for that. Those were very nice words you just said I've never heard her say something so nice so that means a lot to hear. I also like a, a day doesn't go by that someone doesn't ask about Christy and like I'm more proud of her accomplishments than anything else and I like brag about her nonstop. if someone says how's your sister I say she's at camp she's doing great she scored a goal she did this and I can talk about it all day so I I do feel like I share her success and I share it with everyone else too. I'm also kind of excited to see, you know, like what happens after college with me and Sam, like when she's done, you know, like will we, you know, be able to see each other more? Will we, you know, have this whole new exciting chapter together? Because I feel like we've had a couple of years apart, which I'm kind of sick of, and I feel like we need to have, you know, like a big chapter of our lives together. Um, so I'll see, I guess we'll see what happens in the future. I would love that. I would love to play with Christy again. I'd love to be at home in Boston, and I think that would be really cool for Boston to have us there playing together. I think it would like maybe grow soccer and uh, like give us a chance to give back to the area. And um, I like that would be a dream come true if that happened. That'd be really cool. I'm so glad that I was able to see Sam today, even though it was for such a short amount of time. She does have to fly back to Boston and then head to the U23 camp in Florida. It was so good to see her. And to see me too. <laughs> me and Sam have a present for Christy. Hands in the air and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, you. See, UCLA, fight, fight, fight. Woo. Oh. <laughs> That's embarrassing.